Hi, CyberTank. Welcome to CyberTank, an e-home for emerging artists. Um, my name's Katie. I'm, I've been a tank artist for like a year now, and I'm coming at you live from Omaha, Nebraska to uh, host our weekly CyberTank Tuesday show. It's a variety show in response to a theme or question of the week. This week, the theme is music through distance. Um, and I just want to give everyone a brief rundown if you're not familiar with The Tank. Um, the Tank is a nonprofit home for emerging artists in New York. Um, the Tank serves over 2,500 artists a year, and right now, like many organizations and businesses across the world, it is shuttered due to COVID-19. Um, so we've taken The Tank to you, coming at you on the interwebs, the internet. Um, and we're just going to keep doing this every week. So um, we're going to watch some art. We're going to make some art. And hopefully we can uh, get some submissions. If you want to participate in the future, just go to www.thetanknyc.org. Um, in the same vein, The Tank is always looking for a little bit of support right now um, due to the loss of ticket sales. So if you're interested in donating, we'll stretch your dollar. If you go to the same website, uh, it'll instantly pop up and give you the option to donate or you can go right below your twitch video and donate right there so without further ado let's just watch some art first up is debbie shadani with a performance she has created for you hi so i'm debbie um and i am doing this for cyber tank and i'm just so grateful because um the prompt really got to me music through distance made me think of these virtual concerts that are happening all the time and they help me get out of this cramped apartment and um, just help me to connect. And I thought to myself, maybe I could make a concert just as meaningful and help people get out of there. Hey, hey Debbie, real quick. I have a, a Zoom happy hour with some of my bros from back home. We were going to do a little blow off the table, uh, all kind of together, you know, turn up. Do you mind if I, I use the table and mind just like going over there a little bit for your video? Yeah. Um, Thanks. Craig, I'm in the middle. Nice. Yeah, I'm in the, okay. Thanks, uh, I'll go. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so I was just saying that I hope I could make a meaningful concert um, that brings people out of their cramped living space. And uh, this song means a lot to me because it was a song um, that my ex and I used to sing at karaoke and it just still gets to me about maybe possibility and like meeting someone. So um, this is Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jepsen. Oh, my bad. Derek. Didn't see you there. Um, I just I was reading New York Times how to cook through coronavirus. It's a great taco recipe. I was going to make it with my girlfriend on Zoom. Do you mind if I use the kitchen? I was... It was kind of dinner time. Okay. Uh, sure. Yeah, of course. Uh, no, I wouldn't want to get in the way of couples. Okay. All right. Hi, everyone. Uh, I'm so sorry about that. It's just being in New York at this time and just trying to share space and everything. Um, but here, uh, this is um, one of my favorite songs. Um, so here it goes. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, just give me a second. Technical difficulties and everything, but I really, really love this song. I threw a wish in a well. Don't ask me, I'll never tell. I booked at you as it fell, and now you're in my way. Come on! I'm literally in the bathroom! We have enough toilet paper. We take the fucking toilet paper. I just wanted to make one concert that meant something to me. I'm sorry. Hi everyone. Thank you. I I made it back to my family's place, um, in Connecticut, and uh, and so I'll continue the song now that I won't be interrupted. So call me maybe. Oh All right, hi everyone. Um, I'm back. I'm actually in my boyfriend's apartment in LA and was able to sort of escape the chaos. Um, but if you're, uh, we're still in lockdown and I know this is not something that is nearly ideal, but I really hope that um, you sort of feel some connection with me and I feel certainly connected with you and um, the thought that 
this is just temporary, really gets me through. So I'm going to sing a cappella, Call Me Maybe, um, because it still inspires hope and keeps us thinking about the future that's ahead and what can happen rather than um, what, we're, what our present is. So uh, here we go. <clears throat> Dun, 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 dun. I threw a wish in the well. Don't ask me, I'll never tell. I looked at you as it fell, and now you're in my way. And a soul for a wish, pennies and dimes for a kiss. I wasn't looking for this, but now you're in my way. Your hair was holding, ripped jeans, skin was showing. Oh my God. I'm, I... I'm so sorry. Um, I'm, I'm just okay. Um, I'm so sorry. Here, here, here. I'm just gonna finish the the chorus at least. Um, ripped jeans, skin was showing. Hot night wind was blowing. Where you think you're going, baby? Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy. So here's my number. Call me, baby. All right, thanks, Debbie. Um, next up, well, I've been curious what everyone is listening to because we picked this uh, this theme, this question, um, because so many uh, people are just spending time listening to music, playing instruments, singing by themselves. So I'm curious, in the comments, what have you guys been listening to? I'm always looking for more recommendations. Um, but next up, we're gonna listen to Stolen Jars. It's a band. Um, one of their members, Sarah Coffey, was recently in I Am Nobody at the Tank. Um, as Naomi. Hopefully I Am Nobody will be back soon, so uh, let's listen to Stolen Jars in the meantime. Amazing. Um, so I'm going to challenge people to get some more viewers over here. Um, do you guys remember those um, 
those games where it would be like the last letter you texted is the first initial of the person you have to text now to invite. I'm going to do that. Um, the last letter I texted was E. So I'm going to find some of my contacts whose name starts with an E. And I'm going to invite them to come watch. Um, let's see. Ah, E. Hey, come watch Cyber Tank at www.thetanknyc.org. Challenging you all to do it. Um, next up, let's listen to a piece created by Yael Haskal. Um, she is a New York neo-futurist, and uh, the neo-futurists are also putting out content, so you should check out their content as well. Here we go. To be guilty of the crime of infinity is to be guilty of permitting the reckless snowflake, guilty of differential dissociation in a Nordstrom rack, guilty of sharing benign tumors with friends, guilty of the inhalation of cobwebs, guilty of death in the eardrums, of stepping on the cracks, of the brute hesitation wounds, of breathing, of breathing, of Guilty of contacting divinity. Guilty of the R-rated tongue twister. Guilty of rebirthing the human sharknado. Guilty of harvesting the powerhouse of the cell. Guilty of the toll of falling asleep at the wheel. Of hiding the forsaken hermit crab. Of remaining stuck in the shell. Of asking, of asking, of... Guilty of impersonating the penguin in heat. Guilty of unknowingly dividing our time. Guilty of ripping the seams and fucking the seamstress. I know something you don't. I know something you don't. I know something. Guilty of swimming in the afterbirth. Guilty of the virgin delinquent. Of the penitent's to-do list. Of the apoptosis. Of the steel osmosis. The loss of focus. It's the premature resurrection. You are slurping in air and spitting it out. Feel the pulse on your wrist like a new blade of grass. You are cold to the touch and white like surrender. Feel your ricochet heart and its morse code beat. And be quiet now. The grown-ups are speaking. Keep waiting. Keep waiting. Keep... If I was the last piece of fruit on earth, I'd eat myself. Wouldn't you? You, with your supersized side eye and chain linked fence, I know your type. You've misplaced your prized possessions in the ballpark outfield, crying egg whites off of balconies. Have you ever turned up the volume on a song that you love because you wanted it louder, louder, just to find out that you couldn't handle the sound? Could you hear the shame? Did it buzz or did it purr? Tell me how the good hurt feels. You. Yeah, you. You. Me. Me, with my keystone sternum and broad carbon footprint. Me, with my telltale heart only thumping on the... There's a certain chord progression that makes me feel nostalgic, but I'm worried if I find out what it is, it'll become an equation. Because we know we can lock ourselves in that room with the lights off and the palms up and that one song and the same smell and it'll fucking knock you out every time. Breaking down slowly, and with sense. When my epistemology is stretched thin round your dispatch, I really felt like you were shattering the atmosphere around me. I really did, I... I really did, I... I no longer visit, I... I really did, I...
Thanks, Yael. Um, so, I, uh, I had a hard time finding the kind of angle I wanted to sit at or the room I wanted to sit in, and I settled on this very bizarre kind of diagonal angle because on either side of the frame, just mountains of laundry. And I don't know why, even though I have all this free time right now, there's just so much laundry I'd have to do. So um, I'm just wondering if anyone else is in the same boat. Is anyone just like surrounded by mountains of laundry? Um, I guess uh, if you're hanging out in New York and you don't have laundry in your building, that's probably the truth. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, let's talk about our laundry woes. There are a lot of woes. Um, but next up, we're going to have a video from Anna Elizabeth. Hello, everybody. My name is Anna Elizabeth. Uh, I'm an actress, playwright, and a songwriter, as well as fashion designer. Um, I love being inspired by art and other um, actors and artists. And I'm so excited to do this video for The Tank. Uh, I think it's wonderful uh, that the theater is doing this uh, regardless of the circumstances. I want to offer my best wishes to anybody who's going through a tough time right now and I hope that my inspiration helps anybody to get through this difficult time and come out of this uh, better and stronger than ever before and um, appreciate this life that we live as artists in, in a much grander way. So I'll just uh, let you listen to one of my songs and let the lyrics speak for themselves. Thank you and stay strong.
that dress was amazing. Uh, and the nails matched the dress. It was all very cool. Um, thank you, Anna Elizabeth. Uh, next up, we're gonna we're gonna watch some a film, an experimental film made by a former Tank intern. For those of you who are just now joining us, um, welcome to Cyber Tank. Uh, if you're interested in donating to the Tank, a nonprofit for um, emerging artists, head to www.thetanknyc.org. All right, let's watch this uh, short experimental film by Caroline Knight. <laughs> Thank you, Caroline, for sending in that video. Um, I was just looking at the title of uh, this live stream over here, and I realized that when I picked the category, I picked Tanky Tanks because it sounded cute, and now it has auto-filled our, um, our tags to English and Shooter. So uh, neither of those tags are really relevant to the tank. Um, but uh, here we are, Tanky Tanks, I guess is a game that's both English and Shooter. Um, Anyway, what is relevant to the tank is our final performance by uh, Modi Margolin and Emily Perkins Margolin. Um, it was created during Hurricane Irma, I believe.
Thank you, Modi and Emily. Um, I misspoke earlier. I said it was Hurricane Irma, but it was Hurricane Irene performed during quarantine um, in 2020. Uh, thank you to all our artists for performing. If you want to perform again, just uh, email info at the tank NYC. Um, if you're interested and you're a viewer in performing, email that same email address, info at the tank NYC. Um, yeah, please keep supporting our artists. Thank you for tuning in and uh, have a great week. See you next Tuesday.